My name is Melia Wigger. I'm the executive chef here at Echo, and I'm working with Mad on a special recipe by a YSL wedding dress. So when I saw the dress the first time, I started thinking of what I could do that would have lots of ribbons. It made me think of how to ribbon food, which makes sort of a floral look alike, but it's with food. But I wanted to stay with the monochromatic tones, so I started to choose fruit and produce around the orange hue, which kind of symbolizes fall to me. I wanted to do a pancake because we have a really good brunch presence here, so we're really strong about that. So it's a yeast risen uh, pancake. This is one that's a little bit of a fermentation process. So the first thing you do is you make the base of it with a rising yeast. You put it in the walk-in for a few hours. It will double in size, which is quite interesting. And then you start to season that base. So you season it. I seasoned it with a ton of citrus zest and vanilla and butter and sugar and all of the really good things, and that becomes a, a pancake batter. Um, and then with this one, I wanted to bake it in a cast iron. I wanted to actually bake the pancake as opposed to using a stovetop, traditional method. Put a ton of really delicious butter around the cast iron, we pour in the batter and we let it bake. I top it off with cassianade sugar so it gives you a, a nice crunch. I chose uh, flower petals to garnish the, the final dressing with. I really like this image uh, specifically because it's very floral and I find that in my food I really like to use a lot of floral notes. I also like that it's very fluid, there's a ton of movement in the dress which I really, really appreciate. So I chose two different flowers to do the final garnishes with. And then I took chamomile, tea, and I made it into a syrup. 